The Catholic Church of Transfiguration, Victoria Garden City in the Lekki Axis of Lagos, was where Yeye Otumba Grace Yabokwe began activities to mark her 70th birthday anniversary celebration. It was a thanksgiving service, which was attended by friends, relatives, and well-wishers of the celebrant that came from different parts of the country and beyond. Yeye Otumba Grace Yabo Martin Square is the wife of Otumba Senator Jubril Martin Square, a chartered accountant of note who was a former federal minister who served under Obasanjo and Jonathan administrations. Something special about the relationship between Otumba Senator Jubril Martin Square and his wife Yeye Otumba Grace Iyabo Queer, which dates back to 1971 when they got married, is the fact that whereas Otumba Senator Martin Square is a Yoruba person from Agoiwoi in Ogun state of Nigeria and a Muslim. His wife, who is from Ekpoma in Edo state, is a Christian. The lesson to take away from their relationship, which has stood the test of time with successful children to tell the story, is that real love does not discriminate against religion or ethnicity. The church service was marked by the rendition of spirit filled songs by the choir and Congregational Hymnal Singing. In the homily delivered by the officiating minister, Reverend Father Michael, he congratulated the celebrant on her successful attainment of the biblical three scores and ten age. He charged her to move closer to God and continue to serve humanity through her benevolent attitude. The man of God added that it is a thing of joy to see that she makes a lot of people happy through her benevolence. Whenever the people of God are gathered, that is the church. And that, and that, that gathering, Jesus is there. And so Jesus needs you and I as vine, as branches to keep the vine going, to keep the church going, to keep the Christian community going. The celebrant was then specially prayed for. Other aspects of the service included Eucharistic prayers, serving of the Holy Communion, which was wrapped up with a Thanksgiving session. The celebrant, Yeye Otumba Grace Yabokwe, who was dressed in a very eye-catching outfit with matching accessories, was joined by her family members, friends, and well-wishers in a Thanksgiving session amidst singing and dancing. Before this service wound up, it was formally announced that the celebrant Yeye Otumba Grace Yabokuya donated a new organ for the church to mark her birthday. The reception for the big event took place at the Landmark Event Center. Here, more dignities showed up. Of course, the chief celebrant, Otumba Senator Jubril Martin Square, who is the Ashuaju of Agoiwoi, enjoyed the solid support of the monarch of Agoiwoi, who was there with his wives. There were other traditional rulers from the southwest part of Nigeria, especially from the Ugun Axis. Others included Chief Razak Okoya and wife Shade, former Governor Benga Daniel of Ugun State, Chief Mrs. Nika Kondi C.O.N., Erelu Abiola Dosumu, and other dignitaries. Indeed, Lagos and Ugun State virtually stood still to welcome the latest septuagenarian of the moment. Atoba Senator Jubril Martin Square the very supportive husband of the wonderful woman did a lot to make sure that his wife got 
a well-packaged and well-attended A-class event as the most appropriate birthday present for her on a day as special as that. The celebrant, Yeye Otoba Grace Diabo Kwe, was born on the 25th of April, 1945, to the family of Mr. Ezekiel Ikurebe of Ekboma in Edo State. She began her education at St. Patrick Catholic School, Ipaja, Lagos, in 1958. Her secondary school education was at the ULA, now Awori Comprehensive School, and the United Christian Secondary Commercial College in Niger State. Yeye Otumba Grace Yabakwe traveled abroad for further studies at the Pittman's College, London, the United Kingdom. Here she bagged her qualification in secretarial studies. She was at the London Model Academy, where she got a qualification in modeling. That was in 1981. After taking a well-deserved break from paid employment, Yeye Otumba Grace Yabakwe went full blast into textile business. Here she made some inroad. The celebrant Yeye Otumba Grace Iyabo Queer and her husband, Otumba Senator Jubril Martin Queer, are holders of many traditional chieftaincy titles. Otumba and Yeye Otumba Fesogboye of Ijebuland. Otumba and Yeye Otumba Ulubuyega of Ijebuife. Otumba and Yeye Otumba Lafi of Ijebui Lodo, Otumba and Yeye Lua of Agoiwoi, and a string of others. To set the tone for the reception proper, an orchestra made up of violinists entertained. <laughs> Dressed in a smart western attire, Yeye Otumba Grace Iyabo Martin Square, supported by her children, family members, and friends as well as well-wishers, danced gingerly into the arena as other dignitaries in the audience joined them. The reception began with an opening prayer rendered by Reverend Father Michael of the Catholic Church of Transfiguration, BGC Lagos. The main menu of the reception were tributes, accolades, and encomiums that tumbled down in torrents in honor of the celebrant, Yaya Tomba Grace Yaba Martin Square, who was described in glowing terms. My observations are that Yabo is a highly cultured person. She is beautiful not only outside, but also inside. Yabo is patient, humble. She is the kind of person that they will say that so I so she's what you might call a long distance runner. And in the end, the long distance runner wins. Through Iyabo, you have all learned to be humble, not only to be humble, when you have, you can see all the friends that are assembled here today. When you have, when she has, she shares. And that has, has been in, inculcated in us, and we all do that. A special documentary which contained more congratulatory messages for the celebrant was aired at the reception. Yeye Otumba 
Grace Yabo Martin Square was described as a kind-hearted person, a quiet philanthropist, an amiable person. Those who voiced their opinions in the documentary included the celebrant's darling husband, Otumba Senator Jubril Martin Square, who said in a very uh, romantic fashion that if he had his way, he would marry and marry and marry the celebrant again. Her father lived till well above 80 and her mother lives till 97. And my wish is that she should live uh, to 97 in health and happiness surrounded by the love and happiness of her children. The children and daughters-in-law of the celebrant had good things to say about the celebrant. There's a ballet dance presentation at the event. The granddaughter of the celebrant had a solo presentation as a birthday gift for her sweet grandma. Yes. Won't you come on over? Stop making a fool out of me. Why don't you come on over, Valerie? Valerie. Happy birthday, Grandma. 65, 67, 68, 69.5, 69 69.9999999970. Happy birthday to you, Happy birthday to you. And my wish for her is since she has longevity running in her family, her father died at 80 plus, her mother died at 97. Given those antecedents, I have the belief that God will give from his abundant grace, give my wife longevity so that she can celebrate 80, 90, and even go beyond that. Once again, I'd like to thank all of you, and I say, please, let us shake our bones, let us rejoice, let us dance, dance, dance. Thank you. The 70th birthday anniversary celebration of Yeye Otumba Grace Yabo Martin Square ended on a dancing note for the faith band Totally in Charge. From Biscuit Communications, this is wishing the celebrant Yeye Otumba Grace Yabo Martin Square and her darling husband, Otumba Senator Jabril Martin Square, all the best. Only the night we be as one. I sing, oh, 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 a year or two man, God night we be as one. Senator the Sabe, you are night we be as one. Oh, you are night. Oh, you are night. Oh, you are night.